Hey everyone, it's Josh from Bob DJ here. So shortly after releasing their Rocket Generation 4 series, KRK have now given us an industry first app called the KRK Audio Tools app. Now what this allows us to do is it allows us to analyse the space in which we produce our music. The app will then give you feedback so that you can fine tune the settings and position of your monitors to achieve your optimum sound. So let's take a look at how this app works. The first tool we're going to take a look at is the monitor alignment tool. This will help you get the correct angle and listening position for your monitors. Start by placing your monitors one to one and a half meters apart, dependent on what your studio space allows for. Height wise, the tweeter should align with your ears. Position the monitors so they are facing straight out and that they're parallel as seen here. Then place your device square with the edge of your monitor and rotate your monitor inwards 30 degrees. Do the same for your second monitor. The monitor graphic will turn green when you've achieved the correct angle as seen here. The second tool we're going to take a look at is the Spectrum RTA tool. This tool is used to analyse the behaviour of frequencies in your space. From this you can detect what frequencies are most present and which are least present. You'll need a 3 metre stereo mini jack to quarter inch mono jack cable or 3 metre stereo mini jack to mail XLR cable as shown here. So plug your phone into your monitors and hold the microphone facing the speakers. Position your phone where your ears would be in your listening position. Now use the signal generator to output a signal and view the resultant spectrum on your phone. So you can now adjust the EQ settings on the rear of your monitors to account for any acoustic weaknesses in your space. Ideally, you want all the frequencies to sit at the same level and the spectrum graph to be as flat as possible. As you can see here in our graph, our spectrum is nice and flat, which is good. That's what you want. But for your space, you can continue running the tests until you've got that graph as flat as you can. The third tool we're going to take a look at today is the delay tool. This tool is used to measure the distance between a monitor and wherever in your space you hold your phone. For example, this tool could be used to measure the distance between your two monitors. Note that you can only measure the distance using one speaker at a time, so you have to turn off one monitor for this test. Set your reference by holding your phone microphone as close to the woofer as possible. About one inch is what you want to aim for. You can then put your phone next to your other monitor to measure the difference between the two. Or you could hold the phone in your listening position, right where your ears would be, remember, to measure the distance between a monitor and your ears. Now remember that the distance between each monitor and your listening position should be as equal as possible to form our well-known equilateral triangle listening position. So the fourth tool that we're going to use is the polarity tool. Now this is used to check that your monitors are wired correctly and that they're in phase. If your monitor polarity is incorrect or out of phase, you'll get low frequency cancellations and issues with your stereo imaging reproduction. To use the polarity tool, put your microphone close to the woofer of an individual speaker and play the signal. Make sure you only test one monitor at a time by turning one of the pair off Both our monitor tests returned a green plus, which means they're set up correctly. So the fifth tool from the KRK Audio Tools app is a level meter tool. And this is going to check that your monitors are outputting the same volume. This tool monitors the volume level that each of your monitors outputs, so that you can calibrate them to output exactly the same level. Remember, again, to do one monitor at a time for this test. Start up the sound generator and turn on the pink noise. Put your phone microphone close to your woofer again. Use the peak hold button at the bottom of the screen to note the highest output recorded. Now you can move on to your next monitor and check the output that that's giving. It wants to be the same level. If not, you can adjust the volume level on the rear of the unit like this. The sixth tool we're going to take a look at is the EQ recommendation tool. Now this tool helps you to select the correct EQ setting for your space. And this tool is specific to the KRK Rocket G4 range. So for this one, make sure both your monitors are switched on and connected to your phone. Put your phone in your listening position as shown Microphone facing the monitors, again where your ears would sit. Hit the start button to begin generating the signal and slowly and consistently move your phone in a figure of eight, just like this. Now this will give you a good reading across your full listening position. Do this until the test is finished, which should take around 20 seconds. Now the app will give you a recommendation for your low EQ and high EQ settings based on an analysis of your acoustic space. You can then adjust the settings on the rear of your monitors to match this recommendation. It's good to remember that this is a recommendation. Of course, your personal preference may differ to what is recommended by the app. That's okay. So, 
You can use these tools to help diagnose issues with your acoustic space and help set up your monitors to give a solid reference and optimum sound. Remember that you can use this app to help you set up any brand of monitors, but the EQ recommendation tool is specific to the KRK Rocket G4 range. So there we have it guys, a really wicked app that helps you get the most out of your sound system in your particular space. Now you can grab the KRK Audio Tools app for free on Android or an iPhone, but for now, thanks for watching, catch you at the next one guys.